This is a demo of the Mass Data Discovery Portal's import and export feature. First I'll demonstrate the import feature using a comma separated value or CSV file. I have here what looks like a normal CSV file with a row of headers followed by rows of data. But there's this additional commented out row at the top with the special syntax of an at symbol followed by data types for each column. So I see my name is a string, RA and DEC, uh, these values are all floats, um, and int is also a possible value. Over in the tool, we can click this button, bring up an import table dialog. I'm going to browse for my file. There are two possible formats that we accept right now, CSV and VO table. It's important to specify the correct format. We also have view formats here, which I'll get to in a little bit. But for right now, it's important to know that this is just a generic table. Additionally, if you were uploading a CSV file that didn't have data types specified, this format would attempt to figure out what your data types are. So I will now import this file. As you can see, it's recognized the RA and DEC, and it's presenting them in sexagesimal format. Uh, all of your float columns have been designated to show the histograms as you would expect. Now I'll do a simple search using our normal masked query. And now I have a grid of mass results um, and perhaps I want to filter these down by some RA and declination. And now I want to just export these rows from my grid. Now in a subsequent upload I can specify that this is a mass result. And one of the things that this gets me is that this preview column, which is normally just a URL, will be rendered as this image. There are several other types of results that are possible, most of which come out of the VO. One use case for uploading your own CSV is for uploading your own target list and then using our cross-match service. That's another video that's available on our MASS site. This concludes the demo. For more of our demos, please visit our YouTube site at STSCI MAST.